power to go is an advanced burning and backup software with a full range of clever features and an easy to use interface. And now, with the addition of Blu-ray movie authoring, power to go 11 truly meets all your needs. To see this in action, let's author your first Blu-ray movie with power to go and your Blu-ray burner. Once you've opened up power to go click on the video disc tab in the launcher. And for our purpose, let's select Blu-ray disc from the options below. From the burning interface, click on the Import Additional Videos button. Or simply drag and drop the video files you would like to author in your Blu-ray disc. Note the disc capacity bar at the bottom of your screen, which will let you know how much space you are using and how much is left on your disc. When you've added all the video files you'd like, you may wish to adjust the order in which your videos play. To adjust the order, simply click on a video's thumbnail and move it up or down accordingly by dragging it. Once your videos are in order, click on the Menu Preferences tab and you'll see several menu options. Below, you can select from a range of built-in templates, import your own menu, or select Download to choose from a vast range of free templates on Director Zone. For this example, we will choose the template named Elegance. From here, you can choose to apply your template to the selected page or apply to all pages. For use of multiple templates, select the Menu Structure button at the top of the screen to adjust which page you are viewing. You can adjust the menu text and font from the display screen on your right. Using the Menu Structure button is also helpful in this case for editing text on other pages. Or go back to the Content tab, click on the thumbnail of your choice, and click again directly over the video clip name to edit the title text. From the Menu Structure tab, you can add background music to each individual page or to apply to all pages. You can also insert a video to play before the page or adjust the playback sequence. Finally, Select Disk Preferences to customize the video and audio formats. Make sure to match the selected disk type on power to go with your physical disk. So, if your disk is 50GB, make sure to select 50GB. Blu-ray discs can vary from 25 all the way up to 128GB, depending on which disk you have. Another function is Preview, which is the ability to play your disk as if it were already inserted into a Blu-ray player. The preview function is especially important if your Blu-ray is BDR, which can only be written once, unlike the BDRE, which is rewritable. Once you've figured out which type of Blu-ray disc you have and which size, it's time to start burning. Insert your Blu-ray disc into your Blu-ray burning drive. To start burning, simply click Burn, and then from the following window, you can create a folder or just click Start Burning. One note is that if any of your menu thumbnails are overlapping, a message will inform you to make changes before you begin burning. From the following window, you check your progress and even set your PC to shut down after burning is completed.